The Dayton Area Chamber of Commerce recently wrapped up their annual meeting where they reviewed their 2018 accomplishments and announced some big initiatives coming this year. Marketing and Communications Director Holly Allen is here with much more on that. Great to see you again. Thank you for having me. It's good to see you both as well. Yeah, and congratulations on all the big things you guys did back in 2018. Thank what are some of the notable you. ones? Oh, for goodness sakes. Well, we, we added members and we added our new Empower program for women executives, so that was exciting. And so we have a real focus on diverse and uh, women owned businesses as well. So that was. A lot of great stuff. So what can we look forward to this year? Well, you saw as we kind of started this segment that um, Minneapolis-St. Paul photos were up there. So we announced at our annual meeting yesterday a new program called City to City. And so what this is, is we'll be taking business leaders from here in the Dayton region to different metro areas throughout the country every year. And this year, our first year, we identified Minneapolis-St. Paul as our first destination. The reason for that really is we're looking for similarities. Minneapolis-St. Paul went through a metro merger and we've heard a lot about this here locally because Dayton Cincinnati yeah. is so close together yeah. so we're taking our business leaders there we're going to be talking to the, to different um, business leaders in Minneapolis St. Paul about what that was like what did that mean to the business community maybe talk to some elected officials about how they went about it um, and we're going to be talking about all sorts of different things uh, you know lifestyles and um, quality of life issues but it's exciting to be able to learn from other metro areas across the country there you go. So that's a city to uh, city program. Pathways, what's that? So this is an, initi an initiative we actually launched last year, and we're looking to grow it next year. We, we partnered with KeyBank, and what they're doing is funding um, some work we're doing to grow small businesses, and they fall in a few different buckets. So we're looking at women-owned businesses, minority-owned businesses, those that are located in rural areas, but also those in low to moderate income areas. These are typically your underserved businesses. What we're doing is we're helping to grow them by giving them access to the three C's, as we say. So that's capital, um, we're looking at contracts, and also coaching. They'll be going through um, boot camps to learn different things about how do you become a successful business. And then we've also partnered with several uh, community organizations on the workforce side. So we're training people in um, skilled trades like your culinary arts and construction and that sort of thing to create new jobs and build these small businesses. I'm always so amazed when you come in here of how much you guys really I'm do. Just spewing all sorts <laughs> well, of things. Awesome. You just know everything. It's great. Question, go. <laughs> I know, I know. I said, you, got to, you have to stop me. But we have a lot coming up. I mean, those are yeah. just a couple of things. But 29 will be another great year for us. It That's absolutely awesome. will be. And if you want to check it out, maybe become a part of these new initiatives, you can always go to DaytonChamber.org for much more. As always, thank you so much. Until thank next you. time. Absolutely.